Hawking was one of those rare scientists who made science easy to understand, interesting and accessible to a layperson, be it his theories on aliens, black holes or time. Here's a look at some of those theories and how it changed the way we saw the world. Professor Hawking rose to popularity after his theory on black holes. I want to report and I think I have solved a major problem in theoretical physics that has been around since I discovered that black holes radiate thermally 30 years ago. Hawking radiation, as it is commonly known, proved that black holes leak energy and fade to nothing. His theory transformed black holes from destroyers to creators or at least recyclers. He also claimed that a black hole can only increase, never decrease in size. In an interview in 1978, he said, you can ask what will happen to someone who jumps into a black hole. I certainly don't think he will survive it. On the other hand, if we send someone off to jump into a black hole, neither he nor his constituent atoms will come back, but his mass energy will come back. Maybe that applies to the whole universe. One of his most popular discoveries was the theory of everything. It is defined as a logical, theoretical framework of physics that fully explains and links together all physical aspects of the universe. However, to a large extent, we shall have to rely on mathematical beauty and consistency to find the ultimate theory of everything. While his take on God was understandable, being a scientist and an atheist, his theory on aliens stirred another round of conversations and debates. He said that it was very possible that in all the planets and stars that exist, there had to be some other intelligent life forms, but don't expect a friendly ET version. He said the idea that we are alone in the universe seems to be completely implausible and arrogant. If aliens ever visit us, I think the outcome would be much as when Christopher Columbus first landed in America, which didn't turn out very well for the Native Americans. He also wasn't too enthusiastic about artificial intelligence, saying success in creating artificial intelligence would be the biggest event in human history. Unfortunately, it might also be the last. It could design improvements to itself and outsmart us all. Hawking's mind probed the limits of human understanding, both in the vastness of space and in the submolecular world of quantum theory, which he said could predict what happens at the beginning and end of time. He proposed that if there is a beginning, the Big Bang, it likely will have an ending too. Yet if, as I hope, basic science becomes part of general awareness, what now appear as the paradoxes of quantum theory, will seem as just common sense to our children's children. Professor Hawking also suggested that there could be multiple universes, not just the one we live in. But he was not one who believed in the afterlife. Following his theories, it's safe to say he is resting in peace. Bureau Report, Raj Sabha TV.